Why you cry? Huh? Why you cry? Men don't cry. Be a man. Hi everybody. I'm uh, Mark Fusco. I'm the director of the new film My Uncle Raphael. Uh, and it's, uh, it's a brand new comedy that's going to be hitting theaters September 21st uh, and it's the first American comedy in history with an Armenian lead character uh, who happens to be Uncle Raphael. The film is basically about uh, a very dysfunctional American family who's cast in a reality show and they have to invite an old Armenian uncle into their family uh, and he has one week to save them from, uh, from basically falling apart. Uh, my name is Vahik Pirhamze and I play uh, Uncle Raphael in upcoming uh, comedy, My Uncle Raphael movie, which is a PG-13 uh, family comedy uh, opening in theaters September 21st in major cities like Los Angeles, New York, uh, Orange County, Fresno, San Diego, and also in Canada, Toronto. As an American director, I became really interested when I, heard, when I began hearing about uh, this, this Armenian stage comedy that was selling thousands and thousands of tickets in Los Angeles. Uh, and even though I don't speak Armenian, uh, I watched a DVD of the stage play and um, I, I don't think I've ever seen an audience laugh that much in a, in, in a theater. Uh, so uh, my American filmmaker team, filmmaking team got together and we wanted to bring the stage play, that character Uncle Raphael to the big screen, we thought it would, would do great. Because of the character Uncle Raphael that I created years ago uh, as an Armenian uh, stage play, uh, when we talked to Mark Fusco and Scott Yegeman and Michael Garrity, the American team who wanted to work uh, with this project and bring him to the big screen, uh, one of the ideas was that since Uncle Raphael is an Armenian 71 years old man living in America, um, about him speaking English, then in a story it was really nicely developed that Uncle Raphael, it's, it starts with him going to ESL class, meaning English as second language, so we gave him the tools that Uncle Raphael is learning English and speaks English so he can communicate with the American family. That's where the comedy starts and then the audience starts liking Uncle Raphael because uh, as being a 71 years old man, he still learns the language and wants to communicate. And um, the funny part is that uh, working with these great American actors like John Michael Higgins, Missy Pyle, uh, Anthony Clark, Rachel Blanchard, uh, they started, during the shooting and, uh, of the movie, they started liking uh, our culture, like from everything from the food that we were ordering or anything we were doing. And they started calling each other uh, by John, like they would call me Vahik John, and I would call them like Michael John. <laughs> My Uncle Raphael is hitting theaters September 21st in New York, Los Angeles, Toronto, uh, Fresno, San Diego, and Orange County. And, uh, We'd love for you to come check it out and come see the first Armenian lead character in an American comedy. Uh, and hopefully you'll laugh as much as some of the audiences who've, who've seen it already. Uh, they seem to enjoy it. Uh, we'd love for you to come out and, and enjoy it as well. Once again, September 21st, starting September 21st, which is Armenian Independence Day, by the way. Uh, it's opening in major cities. My uncle Raphael. Uh, I hope I can see everyone at the theaters and uh, this is a great deal for me and the rest of Armenians I think because this is the first American comedy in history with Armenian lead character and I would love to see young generation to see this movie and be more positive about making movies in Hollywood because I will be supporting them. You're setting me up to fail, Stanley. It doesn't need to be a hit. Just two weeks of filling for the end of the fall. Mm -hmm. The end of fall is in like two months. I'm sorry, Jack. They don't want to spend the weekend with you. Your apartment smells like cheese. Bye, I love you. Mm. What a lot. Adore you. Yeah. Why do people call you uncle? Everybody needs an uncle. You're providing for your family. This is what makes a real man. I think your father has the potential of becoming a TV star. I'm also his manager. Guess what, Apo? My girlfriend? She's pregnant. You must think before park your car in girlfriend's garage. And don't be afraid of nobody, except a rooster or fox. What would you say if I asked you to be an uncle for television? Come on, kids. Papa, let me read your cup. You could be this whole country's uncle. Really? Yes. No. This September. This may be God's plan for you, Raphael. When a modern American family gets an uncle from the old country. 
Uncle Raphael, this is my family, except Damon he's last. You're drunk. They'll have to learn. Hummingbird. What hummingbird? My mistake. Some traditional values. Marriage. House rules are going to change why I'm uncle. House rules? No more sleeping in the same room. What? If you're really meant to be together, then you can jump up and down on each other till you pass out. Okay, that's disgusting. Kids. What is it with all this makeup? What is going on? It looks on? like a teeny mutant raccoon. It's like my own kid take me. <laughs> this TV show is stupid. What? yippee ki yay mother. Whoa. Wife. When you learn to love someone without condition, you will be loved in return. I didn't understand a word you said. And family. Is it true in China you're not allowed to have more than one kid? One child policy. I wish I was Chinese. America, say uncle. <laughs> Ow! Stop slapping me! My Uncle Raphael. Do I look scary? <laughs> <laughs> In selected theater, September 21st. It's my way or the freeway.